Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Binding of Isaac after the Plus. Last episode, we did a blue baby run, which were, had us being incredibly powerful unless we got blocked from the Mega Satan fight yet again. Anyway, we're going to go with Cursed Samson again. Because I want to do... Yeah, I know. Uh, it's weird enough that I'll accept this as a starting item. I would like to know what causes you to shoot your bullets, though. Is it just a random thing every now and then, or is it like an... I feel like dancing tonight, and then off the bullets go. I don't know. I don't know. I do not know. Anyway, watch us get self sacrifice room on the first roof floor here, where we just don't have the health to make it work. <laughs> and I'd not get one for the remainder of the game. Uh, pessimism, yay! Great stuff. Again, we'll keep the alternative option open, unless I get something really good that I just can't pass up on. Taking Brimstone. Kill you. So the big spider spawns little spiders, little spiders run towards you, the big spider runs away from you. Seriously, who designs this enemies? And I do know who designs them, but what kind of a mind must one have to? Oh yeah, if I don't get spirit hearts heal, or at least a devil deal on the second floor, I'm restarting the run. I don't need my chances any more gimped than they already are. Huh. This time we got I'm drowsy pills. Okay. Those are good. What am I even looking for? Oh yeah, Mocked Rocks, which we haven't seen any of yet. And we won't be seeing any of. Somebody smelling a restart. It's me. Um, well, could be a secret room here. Not quite worth it. I probably could have gotten more out of a pot. So yeah, no Mark Rocks. Okay. Yeah, that's going to be a restart, I would reckon. We'll see how it goes. I'm not going to cut my chickens before they hatch, although you usually use that in a positive context. Here it's more like a it's not over till the fat lady sings kind of thing. Get the bitch sticker. Um, yeah. Highly likely that we'll be restarting this run. If I get hit and I don't get a deal with the devil, then it is over on this run. And we don't get a map because maps are overrated. Well, that didn't take us long. Alright, restarting it. Not feeling the run anyway. <laughs> Cursed Samson, right? Learning the jump, really? Well, there's a black heart for us. Yeah, sure, I'll take it. 
We'll only get half of them, but hey, at least we didn't lose health and we got one extra damage for the remainder of this floor. Woo. Well, there goes that. Why would you give me terrible items constantly? Uh. Everybody loves this room, right? Oh, yeah. This room is best for you. <laughs> I'm getting frustrated and I really should be doing that. <laughs> this game thrives on your pain. Again, if I get hit, restart. Maybe we have a bomb. If you find a mocked rock and can find some spare darts, then everything is going to be hunky dory. But the game does not like you, sir. Oh, this is gonna be f a run that takes forever. <laughs> well, I'm gonna do it in even if it kills me. Simple as that. You wanna play an idiot game? Then fine, I'll take up on your offer. Yeah, you wanna be a jerk about it? Sure, here we go. We don't need to do that like 10 more times. I'm sure we'll get enough health to do that. You think five damage would be enough to one shot one of these chumps? Nope. Oh, look, we can gamble. Give me two hearts. Yeah, I'll try it. Oh, there's an invisible dude there. Okay. Let's get rid of everybody that can shoot at me. And then we'll guide all the others into the flames. There's probably an easier way to take care of this room than to just shoot them. Flies are dumb. Boss will probably have some health for us. So there we have spent life and limb trying to unlock a trinket for this character, namely the child's heart. And you can see it in full effect right now by not doing anything. Yay! Uh, man, this game gets me riled up way too much. Way, way, way too much. Alright, I guess this room is going to kill me. Yay! That's fun, right? No? No, probably not, no. Well, we'll keep going like nothing ever happened, I guess. If you survive. I guess we'll find out whether or not... Oh no, no we won't. 
I was gonna say we'll find out whether or not uh, the effect from or your progress on self-sacrifice rooms carries over from 4 to 4, but we're not gonna get any more curse uh, self-sacrifice rooms because the game's being a jerk. <sighs> Well, on the bright side, if we get hit, we're dead. Which means I don't have to restart. The game will do it for me. Yay! Putting positive spins on the pressing matters. That's what I do. They still sound depressing as fudge, don't get me wrong, but you know, hey. Silver linings, right? In the meantime, I've scared everybody off with my depressing commentary. But that happens, right? And, uh, ooh, you can just spit that over there, okay. It's wonderful that we're getting good items, but, you know, depressing matters will continue until I have a full key in my possession. And even then, I'll probably keep up with it. Because that's the kind of guy I am. If I pin, pin shouldn't be bad. I'll take it by surprise, but all in all, pin's pretty much a jump. I guess we could fight crabs to get killed by him. Well, we might get actually some health from you, so maybe not. I don't know. Are you just never gonna shoot that bomb thing? There you go. Meat's a good upgrade. Mm, and these items aren't worthy of my time. Well, there's a 50% chance for Angel. Not that it served us well in the past. You were there! Or maybe you weren't. Shooty shooty. And all that are good stuff. Can I get all of these? I don't think I can. No. Well, we got the three that didn't have anything in it, so we're good. So one of these is a library. Unfortunately, we don't have a single key. Let's blow them up, hope for money. Yeah, and try to gamble for some keys. How bad could it be with our luck, right? There you go. Okay. Um, library, library, library. Let's check what this is. This is the library. And both of the items are crap. Congratulations. Well, we'll take Anarchist Cookbook. We'll use it here. Just so we can get some spiders going. Um, is this a book as well, though? I think it is, right? It looks like a book. Jump around. Jump around. Jump up. Jump up. Get down. Okay. 
maybe we can leverage that into a better thing later on. Oh, it's this jerk. Eh. It's a good thing I'm not on a timer. That one almost hit me, and that would have taken a full heart. You jerk. Ugh, yeah, that and the Mega Satan thing. Shoot the whoop. Is that better than learning the jump? Um, hello. Shoot the whoop's pretty good, I guess. Blarg. One of somebody who would like that description. No, you don't. Hello. We learn to jump and clear gaps. That is true. Indeed. I'm thinking about going back to... Actually, I shouldn't. I'm thinking, like, if I keep the book, I got a bigger chance of finding a library. But I really want libraries as they may replace self-sacrifice rooms. <laughs> You're not wrong. Oh, come on. Seriously though, a little less health would be nice. There you go. Uh. You got me, game. Wish I knew how much health I had. I really wish I knew that. Now there's another mushroom behind me. Okay, you're dead. Let's take care of you next. Moving. Skittles, yo. Um, bonies. Oh, that jumps. That's why I don't use jumping much. It's a good thing we got this whole plethora of keys to make good use of that dark golden chest. I still don't know how much health I have. I'm pretty sure I don't have much red health remaining, which is a shame. I mean, um, spirit hearts remaining. Pretty sure I don't have much red health either. Four, apparently. Get rid of the spiders. Make use of all the keys we're not getting. Well, say if there's a secret room here. Alright, we'll at least get into our shop. Room back. No, it's mystery sack. Hmm. Okay, let's blow you up for the extra chance. 2.5% isn't everything, but it's better than nothing. 
Pandora's box and restock. Um, let's try to get a spirit art. I said, let's try to get a spirit art. Thank you. Oh, I can actually get this money now. Blop. Yeah, I can do that as well. Spirit heart and a key. Okay. Let's go have a peep. <sighs> Thanks for reminding me. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I do appreciate you reminding me. Freaking guillotine, though. Oh, is that a frail, right? Well, he learned something new. That's something to be happy about, I guess. He also gets happy when he pees, but, well. No, 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 no. Nope. Nope. No, 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 no. So we've got 18% chance for a angel room. But we get devil rooms. Nine lives. Still not what I'm looking for. And that will reset our chances as well. I'm thinking we're going to get another cursed Samson run. Seem to get a lot of those. But why? Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's because the game thinks you are a piece of crap. I should have jumped there. I'm not used to the item. And I probably would have jumped into a different maggot anyway, so... Well, we got a limited key, so we don't need to worry about those. Well, that's a plus. A lot of enemies in here. Can't say I appreciate them. I'll read to that in a sec. shouldn't be losing health. I need it for spiky rooms that we're never going to get. <laughs> as long as your bandwidth can hold it, I guess. Why not? Cause a chain reaction or not? Eh, kinda. I think the game's overcompensating for that lack of keys on the previous floor. 
What do you guys think? Still need to find item room shop. Self sacrifice room? Uh, uh, no, no, no. Okay. No, 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 no. This needs to go. But it doesn't. Okay. Oh, look at you. Being all. Nine inch nails is a pretty good item. Being all multitasky and such. Okay, so we need to find a secret room if we want to get our chances up because we're not even getting a shopkeep to blow up. Nor a place where we could buy some health. And since we've already gotten one self-sacrifice room, what are the odds for a second one, you think? Well, I don't know. <sighs> I should really learn to keep my mouth shut. Anyway, um, yeah, we're going to have to do it here or it's not going to happen. Um, whilst we still have a double chance slash angel chance, let's go beat our boss first. Oh, we're going to have to do it either if it kills us. That's not what I need right now. Uh, we got one heart, one and a half hearts. So I don't think we're going to have the health. Which means we're going to get killed, which is fine because this episode has been going on for quite a while as well anyway. And frankly, I'm not really feeling it. You know? Sometimes the game just goes, nope, you are not allowed to win. For this, you shall be murdered. And that's fun, isn't it? No, it's not. Uh, and we get nothing. What a surprise. Uh. Alright, let's go get ourselves killed. Because I'm headed up to here with the game. Halting progress. Seriously, it's not fun anymore. Oh, thanks for the blessing there. Child's hard at work, folks. Child's hard at work. We'll get the health from the boss as well. Looks like the two sacrifices we've already did on the first floor do not count. Yeah, I will try the boss trap room, but um Well, there's no better way to do it than now. Let's get these things to blow up. Okay. We've got five bombs to look for a secret room, which was something that I forgot. Now you're giving me goat head? And that changes everything. I know. Hmm. 
All right. So what can we do to up our chances for angel rooms? Well, sex sacrifice rooms are one of them. Funny enough. Um, secret room. No. <laughs> and look at our chances for Devil and Angel room now. So it's in a bizarre location again, or it's to the left of this place. Well, second secret room could be here. I am Peror. <clears throat> Congratulations, I hope you enjoy that. Marks. Um, yeah, we gotta go then. Yep. And now it turned into an angel room. What? Ooh, it's the red one. And that's great because if you then go back to this cursed and self sacrifice room, we should fight the blue one first and he should give us the other key piece. <laughs> yes, indeed. I guess 100% forces it or something, I don't know. Key piece 2, let's go get key piece 1. Meow. Meow. Okay, so things really turned around this run thanks to the game being a comedian. There's no other proper way to say it, really. The game's a comedian, and there you have it. Good grief. Jump for joy. Ooh. Stop making me go through. Yep, sure is. And devil deals are on the table now as well. Even though we'll probably get more angel rooms now because high chances because of the key pieces. Sec. Okay. People uninvitingly barging in. Something I have to deal with more often than I would like. And no, closing the door does not help. They just bang on it. I got my girl, let me in. I need to tell you something. That nearly hit me. And you are dry humping a skull. Right. Luck up. <laughs> There's more hands. We got two bombs in total. Plenty of keys to guide us through the entirety of the floor. Probably the rest of the run too. Uh, let's take Red Patch. I haven't seen Charles' heart do much. 
I might be mistaken there. We did get some red hearts, but you can't never be sure if that's thanks to Child's heart or not. Ooh. What does the golden horseshoe do? It does not attract money. I know that much. Maybe increases chances for winning vending machines and stuff, well, gambling machines. It's a lot of health. Why do you deserve that? said I'd stop complaining once I got a full key piece and now I do have one so it's kind of a shift in the mood now yeah definitely overcompensating for something you want some sacrifice rooms here you can have three in one run and by three I mean three so far Yeah, the now is getting strong enough to be able to combat Mega Satan. And Angel deals tend to focus more on the defense rather than the offense. So, if I could beat the odds and get a double room giving me not Krampus, but uh, Brimstone Mom's Knife or something, then... Um, yeah. You would be partially forgiven for the atrocities you've committed to me, Kane. Only partially, though. It's quite a long list. I can't really forgive an entire list of bad stuff for doing one good thing. Coli. That's not really what I meant with uh, Mom's knife, but sure. We can now go touch enemies and turn them into poop. Which I guess is a skill on its own. Not sure how needed such a skill is, but I suppose the world is a richer place for having it. can turn poop into poop unless there's like different varieties of poop I guess there are it's still poop though habit of putting bombs again when I actually want to check the map. Uh, I guess we're good. Monstro 2. It's the quick 
guy. And how about that double deal that isn't Krampus? Or give me stuff like Holy Mantle or... Perhaps... What's that item again? That really good one from the angel room. I'm pretty sure it's not called Eye Abysms, but it might be. Um, Sacred Heart, that's the one. Lazarus's rags. We can't take it. Which means we are just moving on. We really do need a little bit more punch. I can't take Lazarus's rags because the only thing it does is revive you as Lazarus. We are not looking to kill Mega Satan as Lazarus, we're looking for killing Mega Satan as Samson. So technically, yes, I could have taken it, but it's not really helpful. The outcome isn't going to change based on whether or not we have that item or not. Infinite keys. Um, is this going to be the mom fight? Yes, so we can't go in there yet. Right, yep. Hey guys, we're in the dank depths. <laughs> yeah, okay. Moving on. You didn't hear anything. I could borrow. Sure. With our luck, we'll probably get more turrets than anything else, but. Yep. Nailed it now has even more meaning to it because we're actually shooting out nails. <clears throat> Let's get rid of you so we don't get a sneak shot. Bump for the win. There's a right item room. Why do I keep falling into the trap that are skulls? Well, at least I'm killing some enemies with it. Hey, dry baby. There we go. <laughs> That's why we do it. That's not really a helpful item, is it? Oh well. Let's see what's in there. Okay. Okay. Spider webs are messing me up quite a bit. Eh, there's too many not good ones to do that. Ooh, blue candle. A uh, red candle. 
I will take that. All right, I can just jump over the spikes. Duh. Joker card, huh? <laughs> Where were you last run? You're pointless now. Well, no, you're mm, no, you're actually not. I just need to keep you until we're past the womb, and then you can be useful again. I'm starting to get a bit hungry. Well, tonight's pizza night. Okay, that's, that's like our fourth self-sacrifice from game. I get it. You're being a freaking comedian. There's no need to overcompensate, all right? Homemade pizza night, gonna be amazing. It's still a while until then. It's getting close to noon right now, but pizza! Woo. Uh, hate to break to your game, but we already have that item. <sighs> well, now we got super poison bombs. I'm vaguely expecting Styles or Jay to make reference if he's still around. I'm pretty sure the man has better things to do, though. Anyway, um... We got decent damage, mainly because we've gotten hit a few times, but... Oh, we're blue mom. At least we got the candle. Bouncing off against the rock. Don't really know how that works. Fire bouncing off, but this is one of those games where the logic really shouldn't apply to. Apparently, there's a bit available for my graphics card. Yay! That's what I'm interested in right now. Take the Polaroid. That's not a bad item to get. I will carefully blow these up. Yeah. Well, at least it's another item out of the item pool. Which is nice. So are we strong enough to combat Mega Satan? The candle makes up for a lot, to be honest with you. Um, as long as we can keep our health high, we should be good to go. I wonder if I'll find Dad's key on this run as well. This is a final. Haha! <laughs> Here's all the methods in the world to get to Mega Satan. Okay, you guys smack at me. That's not really polite, is it? Still looking for a good card that we can use against Mega Satan as well. We'll probably use um, the Joker card on the Cathedral, giving us pretty much an entire floor where we can pick up a tarot card or a rune or a pill. An Andrazi pill or a Perks pill would be nice, but I don't think we've got much pills identified so. Emperor. Um, it'll prevent me from getting lost, I guess. 
Mm, very long legs, very long legs. I always have to think about a country song or something when I hear Daddy Long Legs. Or a banjo to be specific. And then a banjo reminds me of country music. Or hillbilly music, whatever you want to call that. I got candle from a shop. Oh great, it's that item. No, I'm good. Nuns have it. Eh, doesn't really work well with The candle. Four bombs for absolutely nothing. Great deal there. Okay. So now we just need to go back for our Joker card. Which is fairly decent distance away from us, actually. I don't like you guys, holy crud. Thank you, dry baby. <laughs> it's a weird one too. Let's see what the pills like. Do you know what it is? Lock up. I don't want the virus, by the way. You can give it to me, but... Ugh, I'll take the hard knot. Hard knot, yeah, sure. Hard nut. <clears throat> well, this is not where I want to be, of course. Burn it all the tiny little ash particles. Something's wrong. Yeah, it's a bad pill. You can give me a good tarot card. I can't take it with me yet. So, unless it's the Hierophant, it's probably not going to be used for anything, but... You know. Still appreciate the gesture. Your buddy, I didn't know you could do that. Uh, an HP up. Mm, I'm gonna say no. Ow. I did took, take the candle. It's, I'm using it right now. Why am I going this way? Well, the candle here is a reference to Legend of Zelda. really my best friend here, but... Oh, that could have been such a nice double kill. The flame takes out one, and then the shots took out the other one, but the flame said no. The only thing I do remember from 
World of Warcraft and it wasn't even from the game, it was more from like a book or something it was about a guy s sending another guy on a quest to get his magic book and the book was right there on the table next to him and the guy said, it's right there! I don't know why I found that funny but at the time I did. This is gonna suck, yep, pretty much. Chariot strength. Okay, we can use chariot on a boss. Use, uh, yeah, I did. And apparently, it's better if you aren't familiar with the games. I didn't think it was bad, so maybe they're right. Maybe they aren't. I don't know. actually get a library? No. So that's either a vault or bed. No, not a bedroom. Bedroom needs to be blown open. This re-rolls items on the floor. Do we have an item on the floor? Not yet. Great, now I'm getting a phone call. Wonderful. Sorry about that one. Um, what are we doing here? Getting some health, apparently. Okay. Um. Oh, I didn't even see you. You're blending in with the background too much, buddy. Seems like a good way to go. Just need to remember to go pick up the Joker card once I'm done here. You know, whenever you're ready, just pop on up and we'll uh, move on. Thank you. Alright, there we go. The boss isn't too far out. There we go. Ah, knockback got me hit again. Okay, we've gotten past the eye phase. That's good. Sneaky piece of semi developed fetus. 
Uh oh. Now I've done it. Gotten her in a place I'd rather not have her. Alright. And it's a devil room. Um, I'm gonna do this. Trying to, I don't have no idea what's going on anymore. Um, okay. Joker card. Another one in this I have no idea what this chat is on about. Apparently, it's still. Uh, yeah, that's probably what my plan is. With a bit of luck, we'll get Abaddon. Or... Something else, I guess. Still the candle, huh? Hmm. That's a shame. Okay. Um, go up. Joker. Get rid of the final bit of red health. Oh, crap's fight. It's a good thing I lugged that Joker card around for that long, huh? Just so I could fight Krampus. Alright, let's try not to get hit too much so we can stock up some HP. Plenty of keys. Uh, that rules our items. Uh, I think it's the Bookworm transformation. Even more health. Fills that up. I guess I'll use it. Ah, you're gonna give me a tarot card, right? I've already seen Bob drop head twice or something, I guess. Temperance, not helpful. Mom's knife sure really helps. Yep, this is gonna get a hit. Oh, rune. Blank rune. Well, if you don't find anything better, we'll keep that for the Mega Saiyan fight. We don't know what we're gonna get, but... I don't think it can teleport us out, so...
As in, I don't think there are teleportation runes. Why not? The nut doesn't seem to want to crack anyway. Really? Well, if you say so. Take your word for it. Kind of mucked up my knife throw there, but... Um, whatever, right? Let's go. Mega Satan. That was quick. Appreciate it. I think I did get hit by the double knife blast. Okay, a double one goes on you. Eh, it wasn't a double one this time. I guess it's not 50 50, yeah? <laughs> like I care. Throw as much fits as you want, it won't matter. I don't know how much health we have, but I'm pretty sure we have enough. We also have a mystery rune, which is mysterious, I guess. Looks like Samson's finally done after two or three cursed runs. Yeah, yeah, keep shooting at a dry baby, that's gonna help. Sweet. Done. Uh, just check in. Yep, he's done. Alright, cool. Well, that is going to do it for this episode. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you're doing a series. Feel free to support by coming, liking, and or something if you haven't already. I'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye, everyone.